Over millions of years, species of plants and animals have adapted to the environmental conditions in which they live. This has led to an amazing variety and biodiversity of life on our planet. Coral has found a niche in shallow tropical waters. Ducks have adapted to live in the ponds and waterways. Kudus and oryxes thrive on the savanna grasslands of Africa. But organisms do not live in isolation. They live within ecosystems, a habitat where plants, animals, and microorganisms interact with each other and with their natural surroundings. There are many types of ecosystems. A pond is a good example. So is an ocean shore, a farmer's field, or a forest glen. An ecosystem includes both the biotic, or living components, and the abiotic, or non-living components of the system. All of the living organisms found in an ecosystem are known as its biota. These living things integrated together make up a community. In order for a species to survive, it must have a niche within the community so it can gain the food necessary for its survival and reproduce its young. We are going to look at the interdependence that exists within ecosystems and point to some of the pressing environmental problems that are threatening many of our ecosystems today.